Welcome to Goalie's PIP Academy. Have you ever wondered how cars are made? How do all the parts, like the wheels, engine, and seats, come together to create the cars we see on the road every day? And what about those super cool machines and robots in car factories? Well, today, we're revving up to explore the fascinating world of how cars are made. Buckle up, because this is going to be an exciting ride. So how are cars made? It all starts with something called a production line. This is like a giant assembly system where every step happens in order, from building the car's frame to painting it and adding all the cool gadgets inside. It's teamwork at its finest, with people, machines, and even robots working together to make each car perfect. First, the chassis is built. That's the skeleton or backbone of the car, kind of like your bones. This frame is super strong because it has to hold the engine, wheels, seats, and everything else. Once the chassis is ready, the engine is added. This is like the heart of the car that makes it go. Engines are so powerful, they can turn tiny explosions of fuel into the energy needed to move. How cool is that? Next comes the bodywork. Machines stamp and shape huge sheets of metal into car doors, roofs, and hoods. These pieces are welded together to create the car's outer shell. After that, the car heads to the paint shop, where it gets its shiny color. It's like giving the car its personality. Red for sporty, blue for calm, or even yellow for fun. Here comes our first quiz. Are you ready to test your car-making knowledge? Awesome, true or false. The chassis is the skeleton or backbone of the car that holds everything together. Think you know the answer? Hey, you're watching Goalie's Pip Academy, where we teach about science, geography, history, everything about the whole world. If you want to watch these classes with no ads, no distractions, go to getgoalie.com. If you said true, then well done. That's right. The chassis is the strong frame that supports the entire car. Great job. After the car is painted, it moves to the assembly line where all the cool parts are added. The wheels, seats, steering wheel, dashboard, and even the windshield are installed one by one. Workers check every detail to make sure everything fits perfectly. It's like building a giant life-sized Lego car. But wait, how do the cars move on their own? That's where the electrical system comes in. This system powers the car's lights, radio, and even the GPS. Wires and circuits are connected throughout the car to make everything work. It's like the car's nervous system sending signals to all its parts. Here's a fun fact. Some car factories use robots to help build cars faster and more accurately. Robots can do things like welding, painting, and even putting small parts together. They're like the ultimate car building helpers. But don't worry, humans are still in charge, making sure every car is made perfectly. And here comes our second quiz. Ready for another fun question? Let's go, multiple choice time. What does the car's electrical system do? A, it powers the car's lights. B, it paints the car. C, it builds the chassis. D, it fills the gas tank. Take a moment to think. If you chose A, it powers the car's lights, then fantastic. That's absolutely correct. The car's electrical system is like its brain, making sure all the cool features work perfectly. Let's dive into some super cool car facts. Did you know that the fastest car in the world, the Bugatti Chiron Supersport 300 Plus, can go over 300 miles per hour? Another fun fact. Some car factories are now using electricity and renewable energy to power their production lines. This helps reduce pollution and makes car making more eco-friendly. How cool is that? And here's something surprising. Did you know that the average car has about 30,000 parts? From tiny screws to big tires, 
every single piece works together to make the car run smoothly. Let's recap all the amazing things we've learned today. Cars are made on production lines with people, machines, and robots working together. The process starts with building the chassis, adding the engine, and creating the bodywork. Then, the car is painted, assembled, and connected with an electrical system to make all the cool features work. After testing, it's ready to zoom off into the world. Thanks for joining us on this high-speed adventure. If you loved learning about how cars are made, make sure to subscribe to our channel if you want to learn more, and be sure to check out our other playlists. Until next time, stay curious, stay creative, and keep exploring. Bye. My mind is blown! Where can I learn more about these videos? Oh yeah, getgoalie.com. There's no ads. There's no junk, just cool stuff for kids and a dedicated tablet. Check it out, getgoalie.com.